In this video, we're going to be integrating these four examples. So for the first one, the integral of 1 over the square root of x squared take away 4, you want to look for the particular form that we need, which is this one. So this is going to be equal to, now the a here is clearly going to be 2, so r cosh of x over 2 plus some constant c. And of course we could write that as log of x plus the square root of x squared take away 4 plus c also. Okay, So that's our first one. Second one, the integral of 1 over the square root of x squared plus 9. So that's of this form here. And so this would be r shine, where a is 3, so x over 3 plus some constant c. And of course, we could write it in the logarithmic form as well if we wanted to. So that's the first two. Right, let's take a look at number 3. Now, here we've got the integral of 1 over the square root of 4x squared take away 25. Now, in order to use these, we need to get the coefficient of x squared to be 1. So, what I'm going to need to do is a little bit of manipulation first. So, I'm going to write this as the integral of 1 over... Now, I'm going to factor the 4 out of the two terms inside the square root. So, x squared take away 25 quarters dx. I can then factor the 4 out of the square root and have that as 2. So we would have that's equal to 1 half. So it's 1 over the square root of 4 rather. So 1 half times the integral of 1 over x squared take away 25 quarters um, square rooted dx. And now that is in the format that I need here, where a is going to be 5 halves. So we have 1 half times r cosh of x over 5 halves plus some constant c. So I'd write that as 1 half r cosh of 2x over 5 plus some constant c. OK, so that's my integral for that one. So for number 4, we're going to have to use a similar trick. So we've got 1 over the square root of 9x squared plus 16. So the first thing I'm going to do is factor the 9 out of the two terms inside the square root. So x squared plus 16 ninths, like that. So then the square root of 9 is 3, so I can factor 1 third out of the integral, and I'll have 1 over the square root of x squared plus 16 ninths dx. And so that's of this form now, so 1 third r shine of x over a. Now a is going to be 4 thirds, so x over 4 thirds is 3x over 4 plus some constant c. 